Yo. Just the other day, a little birdie tell me, say, you are come around my way. Yeah. Me and I go wait another day now. Cause in my mind, we are come a long way. Hello guys, welcome to Boxing Blog Center, the home of Nigerian African Boxing. And please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button and also go to the notification bell icon, click it. And so all oh, sorts of dropping you back a uh, new exclusivity will definitely be notified. So let's talk about Lenos Lewis and his silence over Anthony Joshua's win. Um, you know what I mean? Over at Joshua win, uh, you know what I mean? Uh, Joshua knocking out Kubra Pulev. I remember when Joshua got defeated by uh, Andrews Jr. last year, June 1st. Lawrence Lewis was one of those guys that came out all going blazing and saying that Joshua needs to change his trainer and all that stuff. He was very critical, being very critical of Anthony Joshua. All of a sudden, Joshua is doing very well now. His skill set is, of course, has been tightened up. He's, he keeps improving as well. Linus Lewis is nowhere to be found. So, this kind of justify our claim that Linus Lewis is one of those hardcore haters of Anthony Joshua. Emma Tom, Tom, my brother. Uh, where is Lenos Lewis, someone said, someone told me to talk about this and I said, listen, I have to call my brother Emma Tom Tom. I know he's going to analyze this very, very well. <laughs> it's a privilege that we have to share to our people uh, what's going on in the boxing world. By the way, I have to appreciate everything you're doing for our people. Thank you very much, Mr. BBC. Thank you, Lennox brother. Lewis. <laughs> You know, one thing about Lennox Lewis, Lennox Lewis is a guy that has made it to the top in boxing. Lennox Lewis is supposed to be a legend that other boxers should look up to. He accomplished so much in his boxing career. He stood up and stood out as one of those boxers that he lost. He had about two losses in his career, but he avenged those losses. But what amazes me is how Lennox Lewis all of a sudden became a, a novice in the sporting war, in the boxing war. It shouldn't be a Lennox Lewis. Is it money? Is it BBC that is silencing this guy? This guy is fast disappearing from the sport he loved so much. At a time, he should be appreciating a man that takes over him and even aspiring to move ahead. But he stood up to be criticized. Look, Lennox Lewis became a star and more mature after he got knocked down by Hazel Razma. In his rematch, he established dominancy, he established highest boxing IQ, which led him to fighting and knocking at people like McTyson, fighting very well with him, but all of you. Why? Because of the stability, the experiences of him adopting in his older age than running into you know getting guys out in round one round two round three but i am shocked that someone like Anthony joshua who has re-established a right and a perfect better way lennox lewis should be one of those that get behind the queue and support Anthony Joshua, who is also encouraging other upbringing boxers. He stood out there to be the greatest critics. This is wrong. 
He's not good for the sport of boxing. What? Why is it that Alfred Joshua kept proving these guys again and again wrong in their critics? Anthony Joshua is in another realm entirely. Believe you me, Anthony Joshua is another zone in another zone. He's not even in the class with with Tyson Fury. This is a guy. Did you see what this guy did when he fought Cole? Did you see the ankle uppercuts from both hands? Did you see? Did you see how the guy switches ankles? Yes, but for many Cole. That is the highest level of boxing. That is not taught in boxing 101 or just a mere boxer teaching you how to box. That's not it. This is dedication. This is commitment. And this is systematic dominancy. To win the whole world. Come on. I am the best at this division. I may not openly open my mouth to say I'm the best. But I am the best in this era. And I want to be the best in any area whenever boxing is mentioned. I want to be likened to people like the great Muhammad Ali. I want to be likened to the, this man that has done and given all and all out. So Lennox Lewis, I don't know if it is jealousy. I don't know if it is money. But it's a shame, it's grief. And all till now, you haven't said nothing. But you were able to run your mouth all around, telling Anthony Joshua that he's so robotic, that he's not that strong. But come on, man. We want to hear you say something, Lennox. Thanks, brother. I really appreciate your take on this. So, guys, you heard it from Emma Tom Tom himself. He said he wants to hear Lennox Lewis say something about Joshua's performance, you know, uh, in the Pula fight. Stay blessed, stay hungry, stay humble, and, and, and keep supporting the channel. God bless you all.